what's up guys uh, Thomas Cannon here aka Cannon Strong uh, today I wanted to discuss a question that I'm asked like all the time the question is can I build muscle and burn fat at the same time now there is an old parable that answers that question really well and it goes like this a man who chases two rabbits catches none now I believe that fitness and physical culture is a metaphor for the values and the thought processes that can be applied to life. How does that apply to building muscle and burning fat at the same time? So building muscle and burning fat are two goals that represent two rabbits. One is running here, one is running there. They are not running together at all. In order to build muscle optimally, you want to create an anabolic environment via being a caloric surplus and overloading the muscle. Now to burn body fat optimally, you wanna be in a caloric deficit through physical exertion, caloric deprivation, or both. Building muscle, caloric surplus. Dropping body fat, caloric deficit. Now these are exact opposites. Now notice, I didn't say that they can't occur at the same time. I simply said they can't occur optimally at the same time. There is a difference because they do and they can occur simultaneously. It's called a recomp or recomposition. But in order to maximize both, you have they're completely on different ends of the spectrum. They can't be maximized simultaneously. Now there are a lot of people that believe that you cannot build muscle and burn body fat at the same time, and it's just not true because there is an overweight teenager who's never worked out, never exercised a day in his life, who is probably playing Call of Duty all night, sleeping all day, and living on junk food, who if I took him for a month and put him on something like a Randall Strassen Super Squats program and you know didn't even change his diet or anything alone, he would grow overnight, relatively overnight, and he dropped body fat at the same time, even without making any changes to his diet. And that's because of the novelty of exposing the body to that stressor that it's never been exposed to. There's gonna be some changes that occur overnight, but eventually those newbie gains will exhaust themselves and a choice is gonna have to be made. It's either gonna be building muscle or burning fat because neither is going to come optimally and this isn't just in relation to muscle building and fat loss it can be applied to a lot of different goals some goals have synergy like building strength building size they can have synergy but other goals like marathon running is going to be completely on a different end of the spectrum from like Olympic lifting which is very power and technical base you know their endurance and power are gonna be on the other ends of each other's spectrum they could do them both I'm not saying they can't do them both but one is gonna suffer due to the other and it probably be more likely power which is gonna suffer due to the all the exhaustive endurance work that they'd have to do in order to maximize their capacity at marathon running bottom line think about what's really important to you Number two, evaluate what your program looks like. Three, ask yourself, is what I'm doing congruent with ultimately what I'm trying to accomplish? Am I trying to do too much? Am I trying to maximize too much? All right, guys, thank you for watching. Um, if you like the video, please hit the like button. Please subscribe by hitting the red button if you haven't already. Thanks for watching again. Take care, guys.